Okay, you guys. I just finished eating a garden salad. It was good. It had chicken and lettuce and cheese. And it had some um, bacon bits. It was pretty good. Normally, I eat like a chicken Caesar salad. But I wanted to try something different. And I know the uh the other day I had a spinach and bacon salad. Oh, it was so good, y'all. I just really been tearing up salads because it's <clears throat> you know, it's springtime, so I'm trying to slim them down. But anywho, y'all <clears throat> let me tell you something. So So, Chunky, she, uh, ever since she started school, she said, Mommy, I really like school, but I do miss my old class. Y'all remember the class that she used to go to when she was, when she was a baby, when she was one or whatever? And that, that class, she went to it from, since she was, you know, newborn age all the way to the age three she misses that class so uh i told her i said look when you get a break from school like when y'all go on break uh we're gonna go go back to it so you can know go see all your old friends and everything with the group so the first break they had it was thanksgiving break but i didn't want to go because you know around you know, the fall time, people be coughing and sneezing. Same thing for Christmas uh, break. I didn't want to take her up there because I didn't want nobody, you know, make my kids sick. So we didn't go. So I told you, I said, okay, when springtime come, we going to go. Because, like, during springtime, people, they going to be sneezing and stuff, but it's because of allergies. So that was a plan. <sighs> Well, it's springtime now, and we can't go to the class because of the corona. So, she's on spring break, and no, no, her spring break is over now. Now we're on corona break. So, y'all know they got some curfew and whatnot. We can't, they really don't want nobody to leave the house, and you can't. They don't want you going nowhere. You can't go to the stores because the stores are empty now. You can't go. They don't shut down all the nail shops. They don't shut down the beauty shops. And they don't shut everything down. So you can't go to nothing anyways right now. Anyways, so, you know, Chunky, I feel bad because we've been waiting for spring so she can go to class and see all her old friends. And now she can't. Because of the virus. So. I gotta figure out a way. To. Let her see her friends. And everything like. She can talk to them on the phone and everything. But she wanna actually see them. You, you, Y'all you, know. How we are. We like to hug and all that stuff. So she wanna actually be able to play patty cake. And stuff with her friends. She can't do that on the phone. <sighs> yeah, this virus thing, it needs to hurry up and end so that we can get out the house. We hate being trapped in the house. We are people who like to go out and do things and have some fun and enjoy ourselves. We can't do that with all this stuff going on right now. Okay. They said that April the 2nd will be the last day of lockdown. And you can start going, being in the streets again. You can go run errands and do whatever you want to do. That's what they are saying. April the 2nd. So, I'm hoping by then, my doctor be done hit me up, and she let me make an appointment, but 
you already know on April the second, people gonna be making their appointments and the doctors they gonna all be booked and everything gonna be booked because we, we don't have to go this period without it. So it everything is gonna be full. So man, I yeah. I can't wait. Like I really, really can't wait because I hate being trapped in the house. I dislike being trapped in the house. I just, and then people are starting to work my nerve. And, and I know it's because, I know I'm irritated because we locked in, you know, so... Just people are getting on my nerves. I'm ready. I'm ready to get in these streets and um do some things. You know, I want to go see some people. I just <laughs> man, I'm tired of being locked in the house. Y'all, let me know how y'all feel about being locked up in the house. You know. Say I'm locked up, won't let me out. <laughs> but yeah, y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Are y'all homebodies? Because I do know some people that are homebodies and that are enjoying being home. And then some of the jobs are shutting down. And, you know, people, they're excited about not having to go to work. And woo to woo <sighs> baby. I do not like being stuck in the house. So you guys, my nurses, they've been hitting me up. Asking me, do I need, do my girls need, Do we, is there anything we need? Because they can go get it. Because the nurses, they got passes. That they are allowed to be in the streets and... They won't be in, get in trouble for the with the, with the police won't mess with them because they got passes. So they're able to go get things and whatnot. They can do more than any other regular person can do. So they've been calling and asking me, do we need anything? And, um... Like, the only thing I can, like, think of off of my head that we need is water. You know, the, the basic stuff. You know what I mean? And uh, that's what I told them. You know, I just gave them, like, a, a a list of basic stuff. And they was like, what do you want? I was like, that stuff that I told you, that stuff from the list. They was like, nah. They was like, that's what you need. They said, but what do you want? I was like, I don't know. I was like, you know, it, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And they was like, no, because you stuck in the house. It was like, you can't go nowhere. And they said, we know you. You like to be out and about. They was like, so what do you want? And we'll go get it. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, let me think about it and I'll let you know. Yo, I don't know what to tell them because it's a lot of stuff I want, but I want to do it myself. I don't want nobody to go, go get the stuff. I want to do it myself. But, you know, I can't. So, I don't know, y'all. What y'all think I should tell them? Just tell them don't even worry about it. I don't know, y'all. I don't know, y'all. Cause they keep asking me and, and speaking of that yeah so my friends my friends been hitting me up too of course they always do and they like uh you know they mad because they can't go in the streets and they can't come see me so they like uh you know are you okay i'm like yeah i'm okay and they like you know they they're mad they're like we want to see you I'm like, 
I know. I'm like, I want to see y'all too, but we can't leave the house. And, you know, my friends, they they are really upset. But, and they, they're worried. They was like, we need to see you. I understand. I understand. I love y'all, but y'all can't leave the house. I can't leave the house. We can't sneak out. Yeah, because normally we would. But, you know, I don't want any of us to get sick or, you know what I'm saying, touch something or, you know. Yeah, we just got to, we just got to wait it out, you know. It, that's what we got to do, y'all. I know that y'all want to see each other. I know I miss y'all too. I love y'all too. But for our safety, we have to stay in the house. We're not going to sneak out, even though I want to. But I know it's not good right now. Yeah, we just got to wait it out. You know, y'all stay home. Be safe, okay? Don't. No sneaking out. We, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. I mean, we wouldn't be able to go nowhere anyways. Because if the police stop us, don't none of us have the passes. I mean, you can go, like, to a pharmacy and... Let them test you and everything, and you can get the pass that say that you're okay. But even with those passes, they don't want you in the street. So, y'all, we got to stay at home. So, y'all, just, y'all stay at y'all house. We just, y'all, we just going to have to wait it out, okay? One, one, stay, let us, you know, when all this is over, y'all know we're going to get together and have a good time, have fun. But right now, we can't, we cannot. And don't y'all be trying to give me no ideas. Don't put no ideas in my head, y'all. Don't, y'all know how I am. Don't be giving me no ideas, okay? I miss y'all too, and I love y'all.